हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई एम संपदा कुलकर्णी वेलकम्स यू इन माय चैनल टेक टॉक्स इन दिस वीडियो सीरीज आई एम एक्सप्लेनिंग यू द कंसेप्ट ऑफ बाइनरी सर्च ट्री टिल नाउ वी हैव कवर्ड इंट्रोडक्शन रिप्रेजेंटेशन एंड डिफरेंट ऑपरेशंस दैट कैन बी परफॉर्म ऑन अ बाइनरी सर्च ट्री इन द नेक्स्ट वीडियो ऑफ दिस वीडियो सीरीज आई हैड एक्सप्लेन हाउ टू क्रिएट अ बाइनरी सर्च ट्री एंड हाउ टू इंसर्ट अ नोड into a binary search tree with two different solved examples and now in this current video i am explaining you the concept of search operation on a binary search tree you can find the next videos in this video series are how to perform delete operation on to the binary search tree with the solved example and how to display or how to traverse the binary search tree that also you can see with different solved examples so let's start with the content of a binary search tree and today's topic before moving to the content i would like to request you to subscribe my channel tech talks and keep the bell ringing now let's start with the concept of binary search tree for the introduction of binary search tree here i am providing you some details so the binary search tree is a special kind of a binary tree it is having a special behavior or it is also having a special characteristic or property so what is that characteristic so every time a node if it is belonging to the left sub tree then it should be having a value which is less than its parent node and a node is having the higher weightage than that of the parent node should belong to the right sub tree for your reference i am providing you one example here you can see that if this is a node 14 and if it is belonging to the left sub tree of a root node 27 you can observe here it is having a value which is less than that of the value of a root node and any value you can take from a right sub tree from this right sub tree here you can see that say 43 it is having greater value than that of its parent node 35 as well as a root node 27 because 43 is belonging to the right sub tree of a root node 27 so this is the property of the binary search tree now let's focus on the operation which we are going to learn in this video series or in this video session so it's nothing but the search operation which will helpful to search any particular element item node from a binary search tree so let's start with the search operation on binary search tree so what is search operation so as i explained previously this search operation will help you to search a particular key from a constructed binary search tree whenever we are going to perform search operation we need to start from the root node itself and we have to go on searching at the next level fo by following some rules what the rules we supposed to follow we supposed to follow the same rules which are which is nothing but the property of a binary search tree that is nothing but the node if we are going to search is having value less than the root node we will go on searching only in the left sub tree and other way round if the value which we are going to search a key value is greater than the root node then we will go forward for searching in a right sub tree only these rules we supposed to follow to perform search operation on to the binary search tree if it reaches to the desired node then we can say that search is successful otherwise we will say that search is unsuccessful so let's start with the solved example here i am going to cover two different examples in this video session so this is the first example and with this first example i am showing you the constructed binary search tree let's accept a key value from a user it's 36 and let's start comparing it with the root node so my first step is to compare search key with a root node 
so my root node is 56 let's compare it with 56 as key value 36 is having lesser value than that of a root node then we will take a decision that we will follow a rule that let's search for the key value in left subtree only as 36 is less than 56 what the decision we have to take we have to go into the next level in a left subtree so let's compare 25 as a root node with the key value 36 here you can see that the key value 36 is greater than a current root node 25 so that's why as far as the rules of binary search tree are concerned if the key value is greater than a root node we will go forward for a right subtree so as a key is greater than a root node go to the next level into the right subtree so let's move to the right subtree and let's compare it with a key value and here you can see that the key value is equal to the current root node and hence we can say that the search is successful search in this way we can perform the search operation on any of the constructed binary search tree which will help you to search any particular key by following the rules and the property of a binary search tree let's start with the second example and let's consider this is the constructed binary search trees available with us let's accept the key value from a user it is 20 now let's start by comparing a root node with the key value 20 as key value 20 is less than that of the value of a root node let's move into the left subtree only let's focus on the left subtree only let's step down to the left child of a root node and make this as a current node so let's compare the key value with a current node 25 as again the key value is less than the root node then let's focus on its left subtree only as binary search tree says that if the key value is less than the root node then it will belong to the left subtree only so we are dividing our problem into the half because the binary search tree in which the search operation follows the divide and conquer type of algorithm which divides your problem into half and as far as the property of a binary search tree is concerned we will focus either only on a left subtree or only in a right subtree so as my key value is less than current root node 25 i am going to focus only on a left subtree of 25 let's step down to the left child of a current root node 25 and make it as a new root node so let's compare your key value with the current root node 19 and as the key value is greater than the current root node let's check for its right child and a right subtree yes it is present so step down to the right child and make it as a current root node so let's make 22 as a current root node and let's compare the key value with the current root node here as the key value 20 is having less value than that of a current root node value let's check for its left child as no left child is present it means that no left subtree is present and hence it says that your search is unsuccessful as when you are going to reach at the leaf node it indicates that no more values are available for comparison and hence your search is unsuccessful so in this way i can perform the search operation on a binary search tree so thank you friends for listening and watching this video if you like the content and the video please do not forget to give the comment and do not forget to share it with your friends here i am providing you a shortcut link for a next video of this video series and the whole video series i am providing you in the form of playlist if you have not subscribed my channel tech talks then i am providing you a subscription link as well do subscribe the channel happy data structuring happy learning thank you